people. And I don't want to bum people out because they're okay. There are some silver linings. For example, if the world is ending, um, you don't have to put away the leftovers. And I hate putting away leftovers. So there is that. So there are some bright spots. Well, you know, I have to say, you are an eternal optimist, I think. Um, throughout almost all your career, I mean, I've I've heard uh, quotes from you as far as the bright side to nuclear war will be the resurgence of folk music. Um, I believe that nuclear <laughs> war will bring back folk music. Um, uh, and I love folk music. So again, you're right. Another positive. Um, being trapped under a, a beam under an earth uh, during an earthquake for three days, you're at least going to lose weight. I mean, like... You have such there great are, quotes. <laughs> yeah, there are positives. You know, a lot of people think of, you know, being trapped beneath rubble as an entirely negative thing. It isn't. Uh, there's there's the weight loss. Uh, my kids, uh, in my, when my kids were little, they they wanted those. I acquiesced and got them those uh, those light up shoes, you know, the little sneakers that when their foot hits the ground. And uh, I I did it mostly in case there was an earthquake the, the idea that your kid is just blinking over on the other side of the room i thought see that's I found him. i got him over here that's not just decadence that's <laughs> that's safety that's safe that's it's precautions yeah i'm curious like where does the optimism come from where do you where do you get these takes from uh well really i think it's more just a really dark sense of humor <laughs> <laughs> Which, you know, which is, you know, nature, it's not enough. I mean, we have to vote, uh, you know, and we may be called on to do more than just voting, but we certainly have to vote. We have to help one another, find, you know, uh, make sure your friends are registered to vote. Make sure you check that you're still registered, especially if you live in a red state, because they do like to purge the voting list. Um, but, uh, but nature did give us a um, coping mechanism, which is a sense of humor. And uh, so when there's more to cope with, I think that it, it comes into play more. Just, I want to turn to the podcast really quick. Um, yeah. We, we were just kind of talking about, you know, these kind of crazy existential threats that we have coming at us. And like one of the interviews on your podcast kind of veers into that direction. That was surprisingly with Kelly Carlin. Um, can, oh, yeah. you, can you explain like why you had her on the show and like what was going on? Because um, some people might not know about what happened this year with that. Uh, let's see. OK, so it, it actually is uh, it's a, a little bit convoluted, which is some, you know, random podcaster. I think it was a couple of young guys. Um, uh is supposedly had made an AI version of George Carlin, Kelly Carlin's father, um, and made a um, like a comedy uh, concert out of it. And so she sued them. But it turns out that they didn't exactly use AI somehow. So, um, but the idea would be the same, which is, you know, uh, my understanding, and again, I'm not an expert, which is why I wanted Kelly Carlin to explain. I mean, uh, because she she sued them and won. Mm -hmm. You know, she ha had success at this. You know, what, what AI does is it gathers everything from that which has already been on the internet. Mm -hmm. So, you know, that you know, that, that expression, um, if about, if you're not, if you're not getting paid on the internet, then you're the product. Mm -hmm. Uh, so it's that like all of us that tweet things, uh, post things of ourselves, make it right. All of that it's the ingredients that go into any kind of AI thing, which means that we're all kind of ripped off. Mm -hmm. uh, in in the case of uh, Kelly College father, it was it was specific to him, mm -hmm. uh, and uh, so it's ironically, I mean, it, she even says that the the podcasters were fans of him, which is I think so ironic because it's so antithetical to who he was. 
as right. a person, as an entertainer. Yeah, the, uh, you know, the AI thing is just so damn fraught. Yes. Uh, I don't, you know, so many times, uh, although, as I've said on my podcast, I very much enjoyed the wheel mm -hmm. uh, and I use it almost every day. Um, but I, but so much of technology people celebrate just because it's new technology um, with very little, and, and we're always sort of forced into it because that's what everyone's doing. Uh, and like I would argue that social networking has had a negative impact much more than it's had a positive impact. You know, people will say, yes, but kids can communicate with other children from around the world. Well, yeah, but I don't think that's generally what they're doing. There's, it's not generally like an exchange of cultural ideas. I don't think that's really the main way that it's been used. You know, it's mainly been used uh, to, in terms of kids, you know, to make girls feel bad about their bodies and to, you know, uh, and to help the sex exploitation industry. Outside of that, I, you know, it's not a lot of positives. We had that, we had that thing this year where they had the uh, mirror slash camera in New York City and I think Ireland. And it had to immediately get shut down because all the New Yorkers kept flashing the camera. Oh wait, what what so what was it? It was like it was like a it was a camera that linked all of the New Yorkers to everybody in Ireland and all the Ireland people to everybody in New York so we could all see each other. And everybody just started like exposing their genitalia. <laughs> and like <laughs> What's the matter with us? Um, but I mean, what did anybody think that anybody was going to, I mean, you could have guessed that, right? You could have guessed that that's what would happen. Did you really think it was, you know, going to be people exchanging recipes or, uh, <laughs> you know, saying some meaningful, deep thing that, uh, you know, couldn't be acquired in another way? Probably not. 